Hello, hello, welcome to another top 5 mods of Prison Architect. Today we're looking at 5 mods, well it's, it's really 6, but the 6th one just isn't really a mod you can show off, it just kind of happens once you get it. So, let's just go straight into the first one, shall we? Which one last up? I'll start with the ping pong table, that's like the least one. I just press play. The, the ping pong table is a thing for the common room, obviously, and it's pretty self-explanatory. It replaces the pool table. You can still get the pool table, but the ping pong table, I think it's just because it's a bit different rather than the usual pool table. You can have the ping pong table and there's people escaping. Okay, uh, bad, way, bad way to begin a video. Probably should have picked a better map to put all these in. But yeah, anyway. Uh, so that is the ping pong table. Let's go on to the next one. Is, I'll go with the new power system. These. This is the new object. It's obviously panels. The object for the power um, station. If you don't like the look of the power station, then you can go with this. Uh, it's really good. I mean, it's a lot bigger. It is all just one thing. So, like, I originally had it in here. But when I put in the mod, because it just changes over the sprite for the power station, so it changed over to this and it just it was huge it was like right up to here so i had to move over here but it does look a bit different the, the, the mods i speak are more about aesthetics but it is kind of gameplay as well so since this one's here i'll do this one now this is this is probably the most helpful one this is probably my favorite one this week it is a way to like see say you're building a big you're building a whole new block on to your prison but you don't want to hire loads of your staff to get it done quickly. But you also don't want to hire them and then sack them straight away. But you don't want to have a lot of them. But you also want it done quickly. This mod's good for that. You can get it in, I'll just show you the three different sizes. Uh, where is it? You can get it in 10, 20, and 50, and 100. And essentially, you put this thing down. I'll just show you, I'll show you when I explain to you. If you all you need is this one and the switch. You just press switch on, and then a worker will come, and then use the phone, and they will phone their place of work, whatever, and they will automatically bring in 10 new workers, because they'll, they'll only be temp workers, they won't have any wage if you've got it set up in a way that can only have temporary wages. Uh, there's no really an issue with it, but it does take a while to phone. I think it takes about half an hour in game time, and then these are all your workers. You, you, you can tell the difference because of the hats. This, the, their hats are orange, and the normal staff's hats are yellow. But that should get ten your workers without a wage. I mean, you could kind of mess with the game a wee bit and just get this kind of very sick you start the game, and then just kind of sack all your workers and then just have these guys in constantly. But, I mean, that kind of takes out the fun of the whole, the whole point of the game. But, uh, so that's them in, and then to get rid of them, you just press, you just switch off the switch, and they eventually just vanish. Like that. So that's a really cool mod this week. That's that's one of my favourite this week, just because it, it, was, it can prove to be really helpful when you, when you need a fast building built, say, like, you get, like, a new set of Ten pin, or like the kind of warden calls you, and he wants you to take in a bunch of new people and, and all that kind of stuff. Okay, uh, the next mod just just to be small mod. It's the smartphone detector, kind of what it says, what it does on the menu, essentially. If there's a cell phone in here, within I think I remember the distance, uh, a range of a range of twenty-five tiles. This will make a wee sound and the guard will know, no, this will set off the phone and then the guard will know where to go. It only activates every 300 minutes, so if anyone has a smartphone within that distance, in that time, it will be picked up and they will be duly punished, whatever you change, whatever you see as a feasible punishment. Uh, so that's pretty good, I mean you can have these in, I mean as a I mean, it is a big radius you can have it. So I mean, I've I've just placed it there for just because it looks looks cool there. You come in and you see them too there. 
but you could have this in there and that would cover the entire cell block that guy's fighting again you could have this in here it'll cover the whole cell block as well so that's that one uh, this fifth one I think it is this is the barber shop mod I've not got all the stuff for it because it does take a little bit to actually get all the stuff for it but once you've got all the stuff it's actually pretty good it's essentially it's just like a job really you just put someone in there So with this mod, um, you just, it's like a job, you just assign a worker, just like that, and then you put them through, I think it's a scheme, like, you can have many windows and chairs and stuff as you want, but this, I've just put in one for demonstrations, and then programs, and if I can find it, how to cut, there's there. No teacher there because I've not I've not got a teacher in, but essentially it makes the wigs, and then you can sell the wigs or you can give the wigs to the prisoners and they can have different hair if that's what you're into. If if you want to have people all with really long hair or short hair, or whatever, that's this is a mod for you, which is pretty cool. Um, there is another mod, the kind of last mod that I was talked about at the start, where I can't really show you what it is is there is a smartphone exploding mod and it's just it's just on all the time and occasionally your prisoners if they have a smartphone on them they it, it will explode in their pocket and it will cause them damage and it will cause a big explosion around them it's a bit like the new phone that's out i think it's think it's think it's been recalled now but yeah it will explode in their it will explode in their hand and that will show you that they had a phone so it's the mod's like a wee challenge within itself, as in you need to try and find all the phones before they explode, and if anyone has a phone, it kind of goes into what this mod is. If it's if that detects a phone, then it will stop them exploding. So it's just a wee kind of mod to keep things interesting for yourself. Anyway guys, that's going to be it for this week. Thank you very much for watching. Um, if you liked it, make sure you give it a like, and if you've got my channel, you'll find the rest of my mod videos and map videos and all that good stuff. So. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.